What's going on guys, your host GF. Again, I uh, don't really want to be on camera right now. I got a big day tomorrow. I'm a Cowboy fan, people, so I think you know what's going on. But anyway, the Raptors, they were 0-4 this week, even though I still like what's going on with the team. They got fucked over in the Laker game. Darko Ryakovich, that's for you, buddy. That's a real fucking coach. But again, he could be shit in a few years, but you talk about winning over the fan base and probably the organization, that bought you a couple of years. Plus, it's a young team. But the defense is shit, man. We're giving up, like, come on, 145 to the Utah Jazz. And, you know, the Celtics game, hey, the Celtics are better. We stayed in it. And we showed what the, the future can be. Now, let's get to the nitty-gritty. Pascal Siakam, I heard a couple rumors coming out. By the way, to all my buddies and everyone at SFW Nation, I appreciate, you know, the info and everything. Um, but, yeah, I saw Bruce Brown and three first-round picks from the Pacers. I'd rather get a big, but there's nothing wrong with that kind of draft capital because then Ujiri, Webster, they will bundle the picks and get what they need. So they're five steps ahead. And when it comes to the Raptors, they're five steps ahead of your host, GF. I do not question this regime. Unlike the Leafs and Cowboys, there's everything to question. So when it comes to the Raptors, we're in great hands as long as we have Masai Ujiri and Bobby Webster. And again, we'll see if we can re-sign Emmanuel quickly. 43% field goals, that's got to be better. RJ Barrett, on the other hand, 57% since he's been a Raptor. Unreal. Can't expect him to keep that up. Everyone's shooting pretty well. Scotty's doing his thing. But guys, Siakam has to go or else Barnes is never going to be the leader of the team. Average more points. You can't have four guys averaging 20. You, you, you just, you need the lead dog. You need the alpha. You need that. You know, that's just how it is. Um, pecking order, hierarchy. Who's the number one? Whose team is it? Who's your two and three? And then you fill out all your Serge Ibaka's and Norman Powell's and Van Vliet's and all those guys. And speaking of those guys, yeah, once Siakam goes, you know, Nick Nurse is on the, the 76ers. I don't blame him. But that's it. The last guy remaining uh, from the championship run, it's good for Pascal. It's good for the Raptors, you know. Maybe someone should tell uh, the Cowboys. Sometimes you got to change quarterbacks or other positions. It's good for both sides sometimes. Marriages, sometimes you get it right on the second one, the third. I don't know what these whores are doing. Anyways, this is a short one. I got weed to smoke, and um, that is the Raptors Weekly Wrap, guys. Go Raps.